So we got us a little water rocket we built just now with testing. This is um model <coughs> rocket. Prototype A. Yep. Um yeah, this first one we ever made. We just, we just made this um base for it now. Pumping in. Going up to 70 psi. Yeah, these things are rated to hold about 200 psi, so they're not gonna burst on you. That's where they run nice. They well, they shouldn't. They're really nice for water rockets like this. So, pumping up some pressure, and we're gonna drink out those two nails down here, which hold the thing on a, on the stopper here, which is pumping in air, which will release you don't it. Want to move your hands. Um, and then the water, the air will push the water out, which will shoot the water rocket up. Hopefully, <clears throat> that's the plan. How much? How much you got on there? Seventy-five psi. Okay, you gotta go. Ready? Yeah. Countdown. Three, two, one, go. Oh man, that is high. And it falls like a rock too. Catch it? No! Oh! <laughs> okay, stop, stop. I gotta get this. No, I don't. It, it got did. stuck in the ground. <laughs> that was a beauty, man. That Superb. Was... That one's so high. Wow. Yeah, so that's, there you go, it's air pressure for you. And I got, well, well that's good because that's, that's the nose piece. Yeah, and that's the nose piece right here doesn't really matter how well, good it, it does, is. But well, in terms it's of not the pressure. The bottle, gotta do it again. Let's go to a higher PSI. Okay. Okay, how does uh, how did it hold up the Let's end of it there? The end here looks fine. Yeah. No damage. So yeah, see what happens is like, this top right here is um, attached. I have a little the, like a bike bike valve, air valve, bike okay. tire air valve through here, attached to an air pump right here. 